I had someone break into my house. I used to be the one who was so independent. I was always kind of by myself in a good way, but now it's like fully flipped. So what exactly happened with this dude? Oh my God. So I came home one night and there was a guy sitting on the side of my street and I was like, that's so weird. Like he just looked like a homeless man, like sitting in his knees like this uh, in the street. And so I was like, that's weird. So I like drove around him. I went into my uh, house and I watched the gate close. So I turned my car off, getting my stuff together. I'm about to open my door and I look in my rear view mirror and he was standing in, like right there with, I just saw his like figure. In the gate? In the gate, right behind my car. And you see him? And I saw him. I saw and his now like, figure. I'm freaking out. And he goes, I need to talk to you. And I was like, no, oh. like you need to leave. And I like, so I called one of my friends immediately. I'm oh. sobbing, crying. He's at my window, banging on my oh window, my screaming God. at me. So then I finally start backing out and I get to my gate. The gate opens and I get out. And then all of a sudden starts running after me. At that moment is when my friends pulled up and they like had him sit on the curb. And we waited for the police to come and I'm like crying. I'm like freaking out. He went to jail, right? He's in jail, and until we go to trial, he stays in jail. That's scary. Yep. So it's like a full-blown selected jury, yep. the whole nine? Like a movie. It's ridiculous. I've never been to court like that before.